Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the morning episode of Toothy Trivia. I'm your host, Emma. Go ahead and get your toothbrush ready. Now it's time to make brushing your teeth for two minutes fun and easy. Are you ready? Let's go! Today's trivia theme is cheerleading. In the late 1800s, before there were cheerleaders, crowds joined in chants at Princeton University. Cheerleading was born at the University of Minnesota. Lawrence Herkimer introduced the pom-pom. His nickname was Herky. Herky helped form the National Cheerleaders Association, NCA. Herkimer also invented the spirit stick and the jump called a herky. In the 1920s, females at the University of Minnesota began to form female cheer squads and incorporate tumbling into their routines. In the 1960s, NFL teams began to form cheer squads. In the 1980s, cheerleaders began to add more stunts to their routines and participate in competitive cheerleading squads. In the United States, around 80% of all schools have a cheer squad. There are about 4 million cheerleaders on the planet Earth. Several U.S. presidents were cheerleaders, including Dwight Eisenhower, George W. Bush, and Franklin Roosevelt. More than 80% of cheerleaders have a grade point average of B or above. Statistics show that among all the modern cheerleading participants, 97% are female. At the college level where cheerleading is co-ed, 50% of participants are male. 12% of all cheerleaders fall between the ages 5 and 13. 62% of all cheerleaders are involved in a second sport. 80% of schools in the United States have cheerleading squads, and the most popular sport for cheerleading is football. ESPN first broadcast the National High School Cheerleading Competition in 1983. In the United States, of the 2.9 million female high school athletes, only 3% are cheerleaders. However, nearly 65% of all terrible injuries are caused by cheerleading. At the college level, 67% of all female athlete injuries are known to be caused by mishaps experienced during cheerleading. The most common injuries are reported as being brought on due to performing pyramids. And you're done! Weren't those two minutes easy? If you like these episodes, be sure to tell your parents and dentists to subscribe to Toothy Trivia on iTunes, Google Play, or Stitcher. We can also be found as Toothy Trivia on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.